and it would hardly be a pleasure to meet no, one of those. No, wouldn't want to come across Pleasure is also there, so that's nice. So pleasure, Serpuli, 4-8, but we settled for 7 here, so it's still very close. 49, 46 rogue points here. Two rounds to go, 20 points available. Janet's numbers. One from the top and any other five, please, Carol. One from the top and then five small numbers. Excuse me, snuffly, the Christmas cold. Uh, five, nine and ten. Eight, six and uh, fifty. Right, the target this time around, oh, it's still high. Seven, two, six. Yeah, seven, two, six. Who's going to get the ten? Let's find out. That is time, that is time. Uh, 726, any takers, Janet? 724. Two away. Now then, Glyn. 724. <laughs> I don't believe it. Right, so, well, uh, she went first last time, so you go first now, Glyn, with your 724. Uh, 9 plus 5 is 14. 9 plus 5 gives you 14. Multiplied by 50 is 700. Got 700. And add the 6, the 8 and the 10. 6. Eight and 10, yes, is 724. Yes, so it's two away, so seven points there, Janet. I did it the same way, but I added the 8 and the 6 to make 14, and then I right. did the other numbers together. and then used the 9 and 5 down here. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. OK, Pamela, you show us. <laughs> Richard. I never said that, anyway. Um, <laughs> <laughs> if you know what I'm talking about. 10 plus 5 is 15. It, yes, it is. Multiplied by 50, that's 750. So you're going from the top this time. Then 9 minus 6 is 3 multiplied by 8. That gives you 24. Take that away and you've got 726. Right. Well, now, six, those six points that have separated them for so long now since, uh, right, well, since the first round. So here we go now. The, the conundrum is upon us. So if you're both ready, please now reveal the first conundrum of this series. Please reveal the countdown conundrum. Any buzzes to say? Colliding. Yeah, let's look at that one. Yes. <laughs> OK, well done. So, Glyn Wigley with those 60 points. He was champion before he came here, of course, but now still confirmed as the current champion, the first of 1996. Glyn Wigley, well done, Glyn. OK, bad luck, uh, Janice. It was so close. No one near that, were you? No, not really, no. OK, well, it, it was a very close match, and we're very sorry to see you go, but there's got to be one winner in life, and today, it's not you. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, in every other sense, you're a great winner. Thank you very much indeed. A goodie bag for you to take back to Lemmington Spa. Thank you very much indeed, Janet Wilding. <laughs> you got to beat him tomorrow, Dominic? I should give it a go, Richard, yes. Did you get the conundrum? No, I didn't, no. OK, well, early night tonight for you. <laughs> and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. That's it. Uh, see you tomorrow, Geoffrey uh, and Mark, and of course, Carol. So, from all of us here, we'll see you again on Countdown. Same time tomorrow to Len. Goodbye. <laughs>Just before tomorrow's programme, Valerie Singleton hosts Channel 4's other daily quiz show, Backdate. Test your memory every weekday at 4 o'clock.